and welcome to my channel. Today's video subject is Specialized Plant Cells Just like animals, plants are made from tiny little cells. Like animal cells, simple plant cells have a nucleus, a cell membrane and cytoplasm. They've additionally got a vacuole, chloroplasts and a cell wall. Plants also have specialized cells like animals which helps them do special functions more effectively. Key points to remember. Cells are the fundamental unit of all living things. Specialized plant cells have components that allow them to complete a specific purpose. Specialized plant cells include root hair cells, palisade cells, xylem cells, and phloem cells. Root hair cells. Roots keep plants in place as they grow and soak up water and minerals from the soil. Roots divide into smaller and smaller branches as they journey through the soil. The outside surface of roots is protected with root hair cells that have tiny hairs which poke into the soil. This hugely increases the surface area for the root hair cell to soak up greater water and minerals. Palisade Cells when the sun shines, photosynthesis in plant cells makes sugar for growth, reproduction, and other life processes. Photosynthesis occurs in a special chemical called chlorophyll, which is found in parts of plant cells called chloroplasts. Palisade cells are the major site of photosynthesis. They are well adapted for this function because they are towards the tops of leaves for maximum light. They have lots of chloroplasts. Xylem and phloem cells. Xylem cells run inside stems of plants from their leaves to their roots. Xylem cells die and their ends break down. This permits them to form long tubes to carry water upwards for photosynthesis. They have thick cell walls to offer support to the plant. This holds the flowers up for reproduction and the leaves up for photosynthesis. Phloem cells are often located close to xylem cells inside the stem. Unlike xylem cells, phloem cells are alive. They bring sugary water from the leaves to the rest of the plant. Next to the phloem cells are companion cells that have many mitochondria. Here respiration takes place to release energy from glucose to move sugar and different substances in the phloem. Okay, that is it for today. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Hope to see you all next time. Thank you for watching.